This one was on another level. Anglum Gambit do be hitting good these days. Okay, guys. 90% accuracy. Okay. In Anglum Gambit. Anglum Zappa. They call me Anglum Zappa, sir. They do be calling me Anglum Kappa Capetti. What's up, everyone? And welcome. Or welcome back to my channel. Chess Doctor here with yet another banger. And in today's video, we will be playing some Blitz Chess. Uh, because I have been playing some Blitz Chess now before filming this video. It feels awesome. I, I have to tell you, I do be crushing people, okay, sir? Even though I started my day by playing two Blitz games in which both of them, I literally just blunder my queen and that's it. Uh, so I decided to keep on playing and I actually have been seeing better results throughout the day. So let's go, let's go on crushing some more. And let's just start. Uh, three minute Blitz it is because I don't know uh, I feel like that today okay so we have this Vienna game that's so annoying that is so annoying uh, we are going to take this because this do be looking free this do be cooking uh, and now we just literally blundered it but we don't care uh, we just do not care okay sometimes it's better to be down material so that you're prepared you're like it okay it is what it is so let's go here now and prepare this check because that's the only idea I have in this type of position, sir, okay? Uh, next up, we're going to go uh, here uh, so that we can open up this bishop. Okay, sir. Uh, we're still going to go here, I think, because I don't know. It, it seems saucy. We also can go here now. Oh, did we blunder anything else? Okay. Okay, sir. We do be, we do be snatchy today. Uh, we're still going to go here. Oh! Oh, this is... This is defending this. I didn't notice. Okay, now we just let this. Oh, this ain't falling. Okay, guys, this ain't falling, actually. But we are down a piece currently, and it is what it is. Uh, we're going to defend ourselves like this because we don't care. We are fearless. And we're just going to jump around a little bit because uh, what else can we do? We should maybe trade this up, but... Uh, it would be better when the queen moves so that he can take with the pawn. I mean, he can take with the rook. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What is happening on the board here, guys? I have no idea. But we are just playing the chess. <laughs> We're playing the chess here. And I'm, I'm weirded out by this game. Honestly, this game is very weird. Uh, but we still don't care. I think that we should attack. Oh, we can't attack the queen. Okay, let's go here. We can't. We are, we are looking saucy currently, so we're going to go here for this attack and we want to go here maybe so that the queen can pass through somewhere here uh, because that's the only idea that they have in my mind currently. Uh, this position is choking me, okay? This position, no. <laughs> no, thank you, opponent. I really don't like this Vienna Gambit. Like, who are you? Like, how are you playing this? This is so annoying, okay? Like, some openings I really like playing against, and some of them I really hate playing against, you know? This is looking weird. This is all just... But I think that I'm fine, even though I'm down a piece, but at least I'm faster, okay? I'm faster for some reason. Uh, we should definitely move away our queen, because we don't want to get hit by a rook, which would be devastating. So I think we can go here now. Like here. I guess. <laughs> We're going to fianchetto the queen. Uh, th that's my idea now. So we should do something about this. My horse is stuck. So we should maybe attack like here. Because this horse is just feeling very not so okay. We're going to do this. We're going to exchange this probably. If not, our horse is looking... He's looking, okay? He's looking sideways. <laughs> Our horse is looking sideways, like every other horse, sir. Uh, so now he will be attacking this, and he wants to, like, open up my position. Uh, which is, I mean, okay, sir. Uh, where should we go? We, we can go here, then. Uh, to attack this. It's looking saucy. It's doing nothing! I'm blind, okay? Oh! No, this is now even worse. Oh, okay. Okay, the first one didn't happen, guys. But we're still gonna co uh, continue playing, okay? Uh, because no matter how many uh, points of material you're down, keep on playing because your opponent can luckily give it back to you. Uh, maybe he won't take this. Maybe he thinks I'm just so fearless that he thinks like he's playing against Magnus in disguise, okay, sir? 
So I think we can, okay, we're going to trade this up like this, because that's the only, oh, but now he can take this or this, like he can choose, okay, sir, he can literally choose. So we're going to save the horse, at least save the horse, and maybe we can flag the person. Oh, I thought he gave that queen, I thought he gave that queen, he didn't give that queen, but maybe he will though. Maybe he will like miscalculate it in the speed of light, you know? You never know. That's why we never resign. This is now hanging, by the way. By the way. This game is giving me nightmares. Guys, this game, oh my goodness. I don't I, I can't believe that this is happening on the board, okay? Just from the very beginning, I had an awful feeling about this game. Uh okay, sir. We're going to jump back here. I don't know. We just have to be faster than him, and that is it. That is the whole point. Uh, okay, sir, we're going to, I don't know, we should just jump around, this is, this is giving me nightmares, because I think I'm defended perfectly enough, I think I'm fine, okay, sir, we just have to, like, reroute the horse, which is not possible currently, what's happening, okay, let's attack the queen, let's attack the queen, because this is looking, okay, I think that just because we attack the queen, maybe he actually has something, he sacrificed it, though. He literally sacrificed the queen. He sacrificed the queen, sir. Oh, I should have probably sacrificed mine back. I think that if I did it, I would actually be fine, right? Okay, no, he's actually <laughs> winning by nine. Okay, we don't care. Let's go for one more. I'm happy that this game is over, sir. This was crazy, okay? English defense. English defense. Okay. We're going to play like this. Okay, we're going to castle up now. He do be having two fianchettos, okay? Which is like looking saucy. So we're going to develop here. We just don't care about what this opponent is doing. But the bishops are menacing here, both of them. Truly are. So we're going to go here now to, I don't know, just... We don't want the position being closed, okay, sir? We really don't like that. We're also going to trade this. And now I think it's time for us to like go here. Or we should maybe just develop this first. But where though? Like here? Maybe go here or here actually after some time. Maybe this. And we should just push this up if he castles up here. Okay, sir. Oh my goodness. I'm still shooken up <laughs> by the last game. Okay, last game was something else. Last game didn't happen. Fianchetto variation. Dude, I can't explain. People who, like, play Fianchetto, that's just so confusing to me. Like, what's this opponent doing? This opponent just... This opponent. This opponent do be opponenting. We're going to go, like, here. Sacrifice ours. What did he take? He took the pawn. We don't care about the pawn. So I think that if we sacrifice ours, he takes with the knight, and then we take the knight with the check and we win the rook. So we're actually up a knight in this type of scenario, which is just weird. I think that that's how, how I should do it, okay? But we're gonna see now. We're gonna find out <laughs> what's gonna happen, because you never know. You actually never know. You can have the best idea in your head, but if your opponent doesn't play the exact move that you were thinking about, it won't happen, probably, you know. Sometimes the uh, idea stays the same, but sometimes not. So, uh, we have this. Oh, but wait! When we take the rook... Oh, I didn't calculate that part. Like, he can just, like, take... Oh my goodness. Uh, but we can actually just check him here we we don't have to take the the rook just yet we can give a check maybe that's better actually okay i knew he gonna do that uh but i think we're going to go like this again i don't think we should give the queen though i don't think we should give the queen uh should we go here no that's looking saucy Maybe we should actually give the queen. Oh. No, now he's up material. Come on, opponent! <laughs> Me blaming my opponents for losing the game. That's the... Why didn't they go here? Uh, that's, why you sh uh, that's the mentality you should have, honestly. Just blame your opponents for everything. It's their fault, not yours, okay? Because they just didn't play by your rules. That, that was the idea. I should have pushed an H pawn. What did I say, guys? I literally said, 
After all of the trades are done and this and that, after I cost, I just push the pawn. I didn't push the pawn. Now I'm pushing it, okay? Okay, sir. Okay, you are now being annoying. You're now being... Oh my god, I'm gonna resign here. Come on! Come on! I was on the win streak and I wanted to show off. And then I come here to film a video to show off to all of y'all. Like, oh my god, guys. I'm good, you know, I'm playing good chess today, sir, sir, no, okay, let's play one five minute game so that we don't like blitz it or actually bullet it through, because like many people told me, Zappa, when you play rapid chess, you still blitz it through, so I think that maybe we should slow down, maybe we should actually think about the things that are happening on the board, <laughs> maybe, baby, uh, but it's more fun when I don't think, honestly. It's just like I'm throwing the pieces around. I'm pretending I'm doing something. While I'm not. <laughs> We're playing accepted line. This is annoying. I don't know what, why do people play accepted line. What is this? What is this? What is... I think I'm going to go here. I think I'm honestly going to go here. Also, I could have uh, checked him here. I can check him, but he'll just push the pawn. That doesn't look so saucy. Let's better take this one. Uh, the position is, I don't know, closed. And now we can do this. Now we can do this. Because, like, what's happening here, opponent? This is looking saucy. Now, because he pushed... Th this dude. This dude just do be pushing a lot. Okay. We have the position here. Uh, bruh, okay, I think we can give a check here, but then he will just defend with the pawn, that would be stupid. Uh, I think just develop, honestly, because we want to target this. We want to target that, but I'm afraid now that my queen gonna get stuck. That, that would be a big issue, but let's go here anyways. Because now the horse is just standing there, he just do be standing. Uh, and maybe after we castle, we should put the rook here so that we, like, have the vision here. Because it's important to look at this, uh, at this part of the board currently. Because this is just looking, this ain't it, chief. This position here. What is that? <laughs> what is that? So, uh, he gave me the check, okay? Uh, I think we should just defend like this. Uh, because I'm fine with trading this up. I'm fine. I don't care, sir. I truly... I, I couldn't care less. <laughs> okay. He do be doing this. I think that uh, we should either castle now or just like take this because this is looking wild. This is looking wild. I think we should take that up. I, I honestly think that we should take it up. But maybe it's better to castle just so that we're not pinned here so that this horse can potentially jump somewhere here. So I'm gonna castle up, okay? We're gonna give him the opportunity. He still ain't defending from this part. That is now coming, okay? Bruh! <laughs> Are you telling me, sir? Are you telling me, sir, that, there, that this was there the whole time? I don't think it was because... Yeah, here, after this, he blocked himself. So I did it in the perfect timing, actually. Okay, okay, I'm... Oh my goodness, I was thinking, like, this bishop checkmate in one move was just sitting here for the last 10 moves and I just didn't do it. I was just like, I would rather cast love than take mate in one. <laughs> but it wasn't like that. He had to put the horse there because he's blocking himself. So after this check, this is the only move that he had, but now he doesn't. That's why he's checked me. This is crazy. I subliminally did this. I subliminally put this up here. I mean, the queen is looking like that. Yeah, the queen, the queen just looks like that. Okay, let's play one more game. We do be filming for 14 minutes, so we have time, guys. I wanted to get, get the black pieces, but I didn't want to play against d4. We're going to play the Englund now. Why? Because somebody crushed me with Englund today. And I, I want to do that as well, sir. I want to crush somebody with Englund as well. Okay? I want to do it. So we're going to try it out. So now, uh, we, I think we should just give the check here, honestly. But he didn't blunder the, the bishop like I did today. <laughs> he didn't do it, okay? Uh, but we're still looking here saucy and menacing, okay, guys? 
I just blunder my bishop today like that. I was like, oh my goodness, why, Tsapa, why? And I, but I kept playing, and then the opponent was like plus 12 after I also gave the queen. So I was like, okay, it's time to stop. It's literally time to stop, or I'm just gonna go back to 100 elo. Uh, now I think we should go here, because then we're pinning the bishop to the king. That is looking saucy. You can't now. Oh my goodness, this is looking saucy, okay? Okay, we just do be winning in this one, even though we're equal, but sir, who am I to judge? Uh, okay, this is now just like looking free with the check. Then we also have this. Uh, yeah, we are going to take this. Okay, now the queen has an escape. Uh, we're just chilling. We're going to, we can take the pawn. We can take the knight. I think we should take this because the pawn is going to be taken anyways. Uh, okay, uh, we can take the pawn. <laughs> I just hope he won't like uh, mess up my queen because the queen is looking kind of weird. Uh, so that's why I think we should go like this. Uh, with the queen back home. Because I don't like her being there. She done her job and that's it. That is literally it. It's GG for the queen. Now she has to rest a little bit. Okay, we're also going to castle up, sir. Because that's the whole point. Okay, he castled, but we still don't care. Uh, now we can give the check here. Because that is looking saucy. That is looking saucy. We're hitting the bishop here, which is defended, okay? Okay, it is defended. Maybe I should have applied pressure, but then he would move. I think, okay. Do we have any, anything saucy with the, with the horses? No. Should we trade the queens? Should we trade the queens? Okay, we're up material, sir. We're, we're literally, why am I even thinking about this? We're up material. Of course, we're gonna trade up the queen. <laughs> I just started to overthink for no reason. Okay, thank, I mean, thank you, sir. I guess this person is a fan. Come on, he just resigned immediately. Okay, so sometimes you just have to trade up. If you're winning, trade it up, and that is it. Even if it's up a pawn, you're still winning, so just trade it up. When you simplify it, it's one to zero, so you don't care. In this situation, it was like seven to zero. <laughs> Because I just snatched up everything with the Anglon Gambit. Let's quickly review this game because I'm wondering what happened here. This one was just... This one was on another level. Anglon Gambit do be hitting good these days. Okay, guys. 90% accuracy. Okay. In Anglon Gambit. Anglon Zappa. They call me Anglon Zappa, sir. They do be calling me Anglon Kappa Capetti. Oh, this is a great move. I told you, just pin the bishop, okay? And now we just took it all up. We just took it all up and we didn't care. After this, it was GG for the opponent. Okay, we traded it and then he resigned. Their est oh, the estimation is so wild, guys. Look at this. Poor opponent. 300 for them and 1300 for me. Okay, sir. I'm happy. I'm happy. Honestly, we started off weird, but then we ended up grinding it back. So today's kind of a weird day. I win some, I lose some, but that's how it is. Okay, guys, the more you play, there are bigger chances for you to win, but there are also bigger chances for you to lose. Uh, but the more you play, you will definitely learn more and practice more. So why not play? Okay. I really enjoyed today's games and the games that I played off camera as well. All of them are wild. Chess is really wild for me today. I do be sacrificing weirdly and I do be playing weirdly, but I do be crushing people. So just relax, guys. Today's message is keep on playing. Even if you like lost the game or like you're on your lose streak, don't care. Just go for a new game. If you want to play, if you enjoy the process of playing, that's what matters the most, okay? It doesn't matter if you win or lose. Like I had fun even in the first game because it was just very wild. So I really enjoyed the position. Even maybe, it, even though I was losing in it I still enjoyed like getting confused over it and being like oh what's the best move here you know I like to think about it so that's why I like uh, and enjoy positions even if I lose okay so uh, guys this is it for the video thank you so much for uh, stopping by today to look at me playing chess 
for some reason. Thank you, guys. I hope you liked today's games and I hope you liked today's video. I hope you had fun. And uh, make sure to uh, let me know in the comments down below your thoughts and feelings about these games. Like, what did I miss? What was happening on the board? Your opinions, let me know in the comments down below. Uh, make sure to check out the description for all of the other info about the channel and about how to join the rest of the community like discord and club on chess on chess.com and uh guys i think that is it for me thank you so much for supporting me thank you for watching me uh, my journey in chess for almost I, I think it's over 10 months now that i have been filming myself and it's weird like i I've, I've been doing this non-stop and i actually have people who are interested in seeing me play which is like very funny because i'm a complete like beginner i don't know much you know uh, but i still have fun so i think that's the most important you know and i hope that my message is he uh, helping someone else to play and uh, to enjoy the journey as well so guys uh, thank you so much for being here uh, make sure to hit the subscribe button now if you wanna uh, like follow my journey more and uh, that is it guys i hope you have a wonderful day play some good games if you have any good games make sure to send them to me on discord or chess.com and uh, that is it guys i love you thank you and uh, i will see you all tomorrow in a new video chess doctor loves ya bye bye